In this video, I'll demonstrate how to go from Midjourney AI generated still images to a zooming animation. We start with Midjourney to create the zoomed out art, then use Runway to transform them into a moving video with a zoom effect. Here are some of the videos built using this process. Let's get started. First step, we have to create a set of images with Midjourney. First, we have to create an image in Midjourney. Then we have to zoom out multiple times to get more images. Let me create first image. The prompt is, a blue sports car, speeding down a road, surrounded by mountains and river. Let's wait for Midjourney to generate the output. I am using a static seed and aspect ratio of 16 to 9. Now, we have the first set of images with a blue car speeding up near a river. We have to pick one of these four, as the starting image. I like the second one. Let me click the YouTube button to upscale the second image. Here is the upscaled image. This will be the starting image for our video. I am saving the image as N1. Other images will be saved as N23 and so on. Now, I am using the Midjourney Zoom Out 1.5x button. It will create our second image by zooming out first image at 1.5x. Now, we have four options for the second image. Since we zoomed out the first image, all generations look similar. This time, I am selecting the first image for upscaling, by clicking U1 button. Here is the upscaled image. I am saving it as N2 to keep the sequence. Now, we have to zoom out again by clicking 1.5x button. It's important to keep same zoom out factor across all images, to keep the animation smooth. Once the four options are generated, we have to pick one again and upscale it. Then, we have to save the image again and continue the process. For this video, I'm going to create 8 images. More images makes the output better. I am not going through all images as it's the same process. You can follow the same process and create 8 images. Earlier, we did a zoom out video using Midjourney and ChatGPT code interpreter. We covered the complete image creation process in that video. The link to that video is available in description and top right corner of your screen. I followed the same process for 8 times. Here, are the 8 images created using zoom out feature. You should have similar set of images after the process. Now, we move on to the final step by using Runway to generate the video. Now, I am inside my Runway ML account. You can register for a free account at runwayml.com. I am going to use the frame interpolation tool. You can find it inside popular AI magic tools section. Here, we have the default screen of frame interpolation. Many of the Runway ML features requires, free or paid credits. However, frame interpolation is free at this stage and doesn't require credits. I am going to upload the 8 images we created in previous step. Let's wait till Runway completes the upload for all images. Once uploaded, make sure to check if the images are in correct order. Now, I'm going to click the Generate button. This will generate a zoom out clip of 10 seconds using the images we uploaded. Within seconds, we have the video ready. Let's play and see. As you can see, we have a nice video with zooming out effect on our images. The quality of video is better than the one we created in a previous video. Now, I'm going to check if we can create a zoom in video. Let's refresh the page. This time, images has to be in reverse order from N8 to N1. Since the images are already uploaded, I am going to select and add them starting with N8. Now, images are ready. Let me click Generate button again to see what happened. Within seconds, we get the video. This time it starts with last image. As you can see, now it zooms in from N8 to N1. 
So, we can use runway interpolation to create zoom in, and zoom out videos. Let's check if we can increase the duration of video. I am selecting 15 seconds instead of 10. Click Regenerate to see what happens. Now, the duration is increased. However, it looks like animation stops between 12 to 13 seconds. We can change the duration. But, we can't decide exact time. Finally, we can export the video by clicking Export button. We can select Name, Format and Resolution. Once Export button is clicked, video will be added to Assets section of your account. Let's go to Assets section. Here is the video we created. You can use the Download button to save it to your computer. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel and like this video to see more AI related videos.